Hello everyone, this is Rerob, and we're gonna see here what I made for my last little project. Uh, this is just gonna be in a uh, fast overview of what I roughly made here. I'm not gonna dive into it, but I'm just gonna show you on, on the run. Actually, this is based on a tutorial I followed in order to make this render, so there are, there are several tutorials around for for this, but this one is for um, explaining how I just made it. All right, so uh, here we can see we have three objects. We have the Earth. Here is the Earth. You can see it. I'm gonna separate it like this, so you can check them individually. These are the clouds. And this is the blue ring. So, the most crucial thing about this is using the Earth, the object of the Earth, to having two materials at the same time, and it's actually being rigged. So, what does that mean? That means these nodes that I'm showing you here. All right, this this is the crucial part. Uh, we animated, I animated this part in here, the y-axis. Uh, so you can see it here in the nodes that this controller, this controller I, I have right here, is controlling one texture. This texture is the whole point of the of the render is actually pretty interesting and simple. So if we go here, we can see what's really going on. This is going to make half of the sphere to be showing one material and the other color is going to show another material. That's what we really want. So so this one is playing in three different materials. It's going to be showing in the clouds and the earth at day and at night because it's going to show half of it. So right here, earth at night, earth at day, and the, the mix, let's say, through an AI mix shader. That's going to do the job for us. So this is saying to this that it's going to be mixing both materials. As you can see here, it's in blend mode and one shader is the night and this is a day. So how can I animate this because as you can see as the earth rotates it follows along and it displays both materials along one line that line we already seen is this line this is the line that we want to animate we could have chosen to animate this make this a movie but I didn't want to because it's easier to make it using notes. All right, so we have the controller here and we want to extract from here the Y rotation. Why? Because that's exactly what we want to do. As the Earth rotates, the Earth is going to rotate along the Y axis. This multiply divide, as you can see here, is set to divide. So we want to take the rotation the in 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 the sphere that is going around is going to be from zero to three hundred sixty degrees, right? So zero is three hundred sixty. As much as you turn it, 
as many times as you turn it, 360 is going to mean the same as zero. So it's going to really go from zero to one. We want to convert zero degrees to value of zero and 360 to value of one. So we have this multiply divide set to divide. Why? Because you can see that I, I, I have written here 360. This is because the Earth, as it rotates, is going to go from a value of 0 to 360. But we also have here an image. This image is a texture and the texture is going to have an offset. This is the animation that we want to make in Maya. This is interactive. This helps us to not depend on a video. We can create whatever animation we want with this. I mean, you don't have so much flexibility because it's just this image. But still, it's better than one video. You want to turn zero to zero, the value zero degrees, zero offset, and 360, how, how do we do that? You put 360 here and it's going to divide any value that it's going around here, it's going to divide it by 360, and so, in result, you're always going to have a value from 0 to 1, which is going to be understood, let's say, by this node. So that's pretty much it. You put it in mix, you put it on blend. There are many details that I'm not going to go because it's more complicated than that, but this is the this is the gist of it. This is the shader, so we we are putting the into the shader the three three parts, well, actually, yeah, three parts. This image animated because we're we have it rigged so we can animate it you can see here that it's actually animating the 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 texture we have the material of day and the material of night and then you have this beautiful result thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video see you